on. Here we go. Hey guys, what is going on and welcome to another video. Today, we're on the PBE servers, trying out some of the Season 9 changes that are now live over on the PBE. Um, today, we're going to be focusing on what I think is going to be best for Lee Sin, at least thus far. And uh, then we're going to hop into a game and try it out. Um, so without further ado, guys, I just want to first make the room page, talk about the room page, the, the changes, and you know what you should expect as a Lee Sin player uh, moving forward into the next season. I'm excited because a new season is always a new opportunity, a clean slate, and they're adding, you know, a few new ranks like the Iron Division, the Grandmaster Division, and a few other great stuff. Um, but right now, let's simply talk about the runes. Um, so as it stands right now on the live servers for Season 8, Dark Harvest has become the go-to rune for Lee Sin. And... It's been kind of strange because you think like an early game jungler, why would you take Dark Harvest? But Electrocute was so bad that it actually became the best rune. And I actually really enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun, especially in like the mid to late game fights when you start getting these procs off. And unfortunately, the first big change that they made is Dark Harvest <clears throat> got gutted a little bit. Now damaging a champion below 50% health deals adaptive damage. And that like builds souls as opposed to like when you kill camps and, and cannon minions. And... And, and get kills and also they lowered the damage on it it's a lot less it scales a lot less now um don't quote me on it but i don't think it's going to be good for junglers anymore um, i think it'll be much better for laners because it's you get stacks based on damage so unfortunately in my head right now i think electrocute might just be the best rune again for lee sin it sucks because electrocute isn't that strong but hey what are you gonna do man so, second rune, pretty much unchanged. I like Sudden Impact. Uh, now, here you have a few choices. This is pretty much personal preference. Uh, Ghost Pour is pretty good for jungling, but I just, I like playing Lee Sin to Snowball. So, I'm taking Eyeball Collection. And then down here, once again, you have a choice between really these two, if you're taking it seriously. Relentless Hunter is probably the most common. I take Ingenious Hunter because I like to ward hop with no Tracker's Knife, no Sight Stone, I think. Anything helps, so having more ward opportunities is good. So I take Ingenious. So this is what I'm thinking for the main page. Now, I do want to talk about something else real quick after this, but let's get into the secondary page. Unchanged here, you're going to take Triumph and Coup de Gras. Now, if you want to take something else, you can, but I think these are the best two. I mean, there's some people take Sorcery, some people take Inspiration, but I would stick with these two. Now, the most interesting change that they've made is they've added like three little like stat pages or like stats that you can choose from so i guess it's like it makes it a more dynamic path for the runes you know so you're not locked into whatever that the path gives you now for the first page or the first line i guess here you have either adaptive force which is like bonus 80 and ap um nine percent attack speed or cdr now, i don't think the cdr increases your cap so I don't think that's good because typically with Lee Sin you build cdr items um now that leaves these two I actually think the attack speed is going to be the best here because for clearing Lee Sin and well, any jungler, attack speed is really good, especially in the early game. And with Lee Sin's passive, I see it being probably the strongest one to take. So that's what I'm going to start with. Um, and the second one, it's either defensive stats or adaptive force. And here I'm going to take the extra damage. And then down here, you have a choice between armor, MR, or defense. Now, you'll probably be changing these depending on the situation. Uh, but I think the most standard one is probably just the armor, just because it'll take less damage from uh, camps when you're clearing. Um, so this is what the rune page is going to look like um, for Lee Sin S9, as, at least so far. Um, it could It's subject to change. I got to do some play testing. But there is a really interesting rune that I wanted to talk about. And with Dark Harvest being gutted and with Electrocute not being that great, could potentially be an option. Now, it is in the tank tree or whatever the resolve tree which i don't i don't love because there's not really much in here besides this rune but it's interesting it's called shield bash it's a new rune they added when you gain a shield your next basic attack against a champion deals 4 to 22 plus 1.5 percent bonus health plus 8.5 percent new shield amount bonus adaptive damage and increases that shield remaining size by 10 percent and you have up to two seconds to use this after it expires so with Lee Sin's W being on such a short cooldown, this could actually be really, really good for dueling in the jungle. It could be good for many reasons. Tank Lee Sin may be a little bit more popular with this rune. Again, I have to test this out. I don't think it's 
right now in my head, I don't think a secondary talent is ever going to be better than what you get through this talent tree. Um, so I'm not going to do that this game, but I just, I just want to point that out. Maybe later in this video, if I get to play a second game, we'll try it out. But I'm thinking that this is going to be the most standard page for Lee Sin. Again, we got to test it out. So we're going to hop into a game with the new runes. We're going to see how Lee Sin ultimately feels on the PvE server with the new season. We're just going to test out the changes, give you guys a feel for what to expect with the new season for Lee Sin. So let's hop into the game. All right, guys. <clears throat> we're into the game. Um, let's see. I don't think there's any ch big changes to the items or the jungle. The minimap looks different. The turrets are a little bit different. I didn't mention that in the patch notes or anything. Because um, this isn't really about the changes to Season 9. It's just specific to Lee Sin and how he feels. Um, but yeah, this looks... I'm curious to see. I don't. I didn't actually read up on the turret changes. So I apologize if I don't explain that in this video. Should have done my homework, but maybe in the next one. Um, we'll, we'll figure it out, though, as we go. Uh, so, as always... You want to start W nowadays. I know that might sound weird, but ever since the Q changes, you're... Oh, that's great. You died. Your rank 1 Q does not do enough damage. Oh, wait. Did that spawn early? Wait. Wait a sec. Okay, so I guess the jungle camp spawn 30 seconds earlier now? That's bizarre. Um, I'm going to do the same clear that I normally do, though. Go red over to uh, Scuttle. But yeah, you always want to start W nowadays. Um, your Q does too little base damage, and the W keeps you healthy, and you pretty much kill it just as fast anyways. So it just keeps you healthier. It's, it's really no reason to take Q unless you're invading or something. Um, but yeah, I guess the jungle camps now spawn at one minute to speed up games a little bit. I kind of like. It does delete the potential of invades, though, so I'm curious to see how that plays out. Um, yeah, I think, uh, I think we're just going to do a normal clear here. I'm assuming Pantheon use Flash for that kill. He's unfortunately cowering under... I, you Normally, Pantheons, they just, like, go all in. But he's kind of cowering away. So, we're just going to go clear my blue buff. And we'll go to Gromp. That'll give us level 3. And we'll go from there. Um, we're jungling against Talia. Okay, so what I'm going to do is... I think I'm going to clear this and then walk through topside brush. Go for a lane gank. But only if this Pantheon decides to start getting aggressive. So right now he's not. Yeah, though, see the wave's gonna just end up shoving on him anyways. So we're not gonna be able to gank him. Uh, mid's also shoving, so it's kind of hard to gank that. Just keep clearing. Yeah, the attack speed definitely feels good. Um, pretty much, you always got the attack speed when you took precision, I believe. But now you, it, it's really, really important that you take the attack speed room. In my opinion, for jungling. Um, Alright, let's go mid here. Wave's starting to center a little bit. Might be able to get something. If Rise... If I Rise roots him. There you go. I was waiting for her to do that. She's gonna flash. Oh, I imagine. Alright. Good sidestep. He was pinging me to help. Confused. It's alright. Alright, this will give us level 4. I haven't seen Tilly on the map yet. We can probably swing back around here. Yep, I knew she was going to do that, dude. She's going to flashy, I think. Whatever. I'll just clean this kill up. <gasps> oh, dude. If she's gonna do that. Boom. All right. Electrocute proc was uh, honestly pretty weak. Like just as I remembered it. Electrocute. Eh. But yeah, what are you gonna do? They nerfed Dark Harvest. What are you gonna do, boys? I'm just gonna tax this wave. All right. He's TPing, so we'll just back off. Maybe I can go bot here. Wait. Nobody got that scuttle crab. Huh. PayPal me after the game, Haz. Sure thing. Sure thing, buddy. 
exposed. Alright. I've got a lot of gold, but I also want to take advantage of the fact that they're pushing. Uh, this is probably ordered. Alright, I'll just get Scuttle Crab, because for some reason Talia didn't get Scuttle Crab. I don't know if he's AFK or whatnot. Really hope she's not AFK. No, she's not. I think she is. I'm gonna put a ward down on her blue. No, she's not. What the fuck? Why did she get scuttled? Alright, whatever. I'm gonna back off here. Let's just recall. Actually, I'm gonna take one more camp and then I'll recall on path to my red. Waste not a minute. Okay, they. Yeah, they two for one, I think. One for two, whatever. Alright, Talia's only a level four. I don't know if she's walking into my jungle right now. Or what? Well, I gotta get the I gotta kill this fast so I can get level six. Yeah, he's blocked. Yeah. I think I can run into her here. Oh, the tower shot! one way of doing it. I did not need to do that, but I just really wanted the style points for you guys. Let's see if K Kaisa gets greedy here. She's gonna get greedy for cannon. You can already tell. Yeah. Boom. What up? 3-0. Good start to the game for your boy. Let's go back and get the jungle item. Let's get some boots. Let's refresh our pink ward. Boom. Bop. Boom. Let's head up toward our blue, maybe help top side out. Top's doing fine though. Actually, no he's not. He's down by 20 farm already. But that's more of just a last hitting issue. He seems to have pressure. Well, now he's dead. I don't know what the hell he's doing. W. Oh, he doesn't have W. Okay, he lived. Good for you. I'm gonna grab this blue buff and then maybe try and... Well, I don't have ult. If I had ult, I would say let's try and kill Talia at a red. Just because I'm like so ahead right now. But... Without ultimate, probably won't be able to do it. Oh, we can do this, though. <laughs> That's good. Nice bait, mate. Uh, let's shove the wave. Always shove the wave after a kill like that. Especially at one T. I don't think Pantheon has TP, so... He might. I don't think so, though. Normally I would, like, be there for cannon, but now that I'm not taking Dark Harvest, don't even need it. I actually might bangy this guy. Oh, he, had, he does have TP. Okay, if Gangplank TPs back something we can kill. I can just kick. I don't know, maybe we can't kill. Here we go. Well, that was a good W, but I think we should... Oh, okay. I got his flash from my R. That's totally worth it. Totally worth in my book. All right, let's go take our topside jungle, and we'll path. We'll recall and path bot. Do I go to Yomos? The answer is duh. How could I not go Yomos? 4-0 against this team comp. No tanks. Pantheon's are the only one with any form of, like, damage mitigation. Uh, yeah. We're gonna definitely go... Early Yomu's Ghost Blade. Straight at Dirk first. And the Yomu's. I mean, so far, Leeson feels relatively the same. I think Electrocute, it's a small issue to deal with not having the Dark Harvest anymore. But I'm not that worried. I'm going to wait for my Altman come bot. Three seconds, two. One, here we go. Woo! Woo! That was fucking saucy. Wait, this guy's inting. Wait, dude, you're inting. Oh, 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 oh. Oh my god, that was a... Mm. That was a really... That was a... I can lie, that was a good to leal. I couldn't... I can't get over I should have W'd here instantly, but I honestly didn't see Cat roaming down, so I was just playing it slow. 
which was obviously not the right move. Sorry to all my Katarina players watching. You know what, at least you're playing a hard and mechanically intensive champion though. I'll give you that. All right, let's grab my red. I'm probably just gonna go back bot, honestly. We're gonna need an early Hex Drinker against this team. That's gonna kill. Oh my god. Kinda missed the Electric Key Burst, dude. That was pretty epic. I kinda missed that. Dark Harvest wouldn't provide that amount of damage early. But, I still miss the old Electric Key, man. I really do. Alright, we're gonna have to just take this Dragon real quick, since we have the numbers. And because I'm so fed. No way this Kaisa steps up. No way. Let's just shove the wave. Okay. Ooh. See, I, this is what I didn't do my research on. You get gold now for hitting a tower, I guess. Like, over time as opposed to all at once. Interesting. Oh my god. That was really nice. Man, I'm just styling on this bot lane. All right, let's take on this tower now. They went, they sent three top, so we'll trade, I guess. They get bonus gold still for killing the first tower, but whatever. Oh, he's not killing it. Okay. All right, I got time to clear his top bot side because he was top. Holy shit. He's out, dude. Or is he? Right. Yeah, I'm gonna run from that. I don't wanna... F I'm too much shut down right now. I believe. Actually, I might not be shut down. No, I, I am shut down. I'm on a three kill streak. I don't wanna fuck with that. Kill that blast cone on my way so that I can't get cheesed by Pantheon. Right. I think I'm gonna have to carry this, boys. Challenge accepted. Zyra. She's practically inting. Alright, let's go get some let's go get some items, boys. What do you say? Yomos, little Yomos, maybe Hex Drinker. Little Hex Drinker, let's sell this, get a long sword. Looking solid. Let's head to the top side now. Plenty of stuff to clear up there. Maybe head mid. I don't know, man. Things are going well though. So one thing I will say, when you are snowballing on Lee, like I am now, don't think that you have to force just because you're snowballing, you know what I mean? Still make sure you're clearing your jungle, and with how much gold and levels you have this early in the game, you'll be able to clear your jungle so fast, which you can use to further snowball. Um, I actually think I can kill this guy. Yeah. I'm gonna kick him just for insurance. Probably didn't need to, but... Oh, Katarina snowballing. Well, me versus Cat. Game on. Let's get Hex Drinker and then we'll be set. I'm gonna get Hex Drinker. I don't really need Black Cleaver. I might just rush GA. Just so I can not die. Black Cleaver will probably be my neck my item after that. Just get a little bit later. People might start building some armor for me, like a Zonia's or Zonia's, Ninja Tab, stuff like that.
Probably could have killed him, honestly. Alright, well, I forgot I had Hex Drinker, otherwise I would have all in here. Completely forgot I had that item. Which is silly because I literally bought it so that I could kill Cat. And then I just forgot I had it. Just get my red before I do anything else. I'm like so used to like snowballing with or scaling with high uh, harvest now that like I find myself farming a lot when I probably at this point should look for some picks. Right, no wards here. I think I'm out. I don't have my hex finger up. That's why I had to flash out of there. But it worked out. I'll just heal up real quick with my W. Unreal. This is like when you're fed like this, you can just heal up so quickly. It's great. Alright. Let's get this infernal. I'm gonna drop a pink just to make sure they don't know. So I gotta be careful with this cat, dude. She's huge. That fucked up. This is literally gonna be me versus cat. <laughs> Alright. Got a BF. I mean, I'll be able to pretty much slay anyone. The only problem is without Dark Harvest, I won't get that juicy reset to make the multi kill plays, but whoever I first target is gonna get blown the fuck up. Blown to smithereens, dude. I'm a level 14, dude. Holy shit. I'm so large and in charge. Uh, I gotta be careful. I don't want to get caught out on my own. My build is a little bit too all in. Okay. Okay. That's how we do it, boys. Uh, Pantheon? Hello? Hmm, he's not fighting. <gasps> that was clean. Oh, I missed the Q, though. Oh my god, this guy's a... Nice. Almost, yeah, that was a nice side set. I ain't gonna lie. Let's get this tower. For sure, for sure. I'm just like, I'm just gonna continue to snowball here, boys. And right now, the way to snowball is to keep farming. Look at me, level 15. That's gonna be, that's what's gonna make the difference here. All right, got our GA. I'm just gonna grab a Ruby Crystal. We'll start building toward Black Cleaver. I don't need to finish Maw just yet. It's a little too early. Maw's like better later in the game. Once Cat starts getting more items, I'll need it though, the extra shield. Get this guy's blue. If I can deny blue from this team with Talia as their jungler, I think that'll be pretty solid. I gotta be careful here. Yeah. Sayonara, bro. That's right, I have GA. Um. Holy. Holy. Took my quadra, but that's fine. Shit, dude. Yeah, I'm really strong. <laughs> I'd say I'm pretty strong. Yeah, GA was a good investment. 
Gave my team time to react to me as well. Made a huge difference. Ooh. Might just QFRQ on this guy so if she steps up. Ah! There we go. I was just out of range there. Look, I can just life steal with my W. Panthan can't kill me. Hilarious. Yeah, we are 1v9 status right now. The lifesteal is just... Don't underestimate it, dude. When you're fed, you can just heal up so much. Especially with like a blue buff on me. Oh yeah. Fuck, almost, man. That kick was so good, too. Alright, we got Black Cleaver off that. Huge. Huge, huge, huge. Yeah, this game's... I think we sealed the deal, boys. Uh, without GA, I probably shouldn't. Just get tower. I actually, like, I can feel the attack speed. And it's really, really solid at this point in the game. I think the attack speed is actually, like, super genius. Okay. Ain't sure about that one. She went all the way over here. I bet she's right here. Nope. Wait. Oh, Talia. Wait. She didn't take the. Huh? I swear I saw her take the wall. Maybe I got juked. I don't know. Blue buff spawning. Oh, he had to shield up. Holy shit. Legendary, man. That was sick. I have my GA anyways. I don't think I would have died. That assist. Thank you. Don't mind if I do. Holy shit. Boys, we did really well this game. I'm really glad that this was the game I get to put on YouTube. This is a good one. And Lee Sin feels fine. Now, granted, this is PBE. Their team comp is a little iffy. But... And we go out with a bang, dude. Electrocute doesn't feel all that bad if you can end the game early. Um, Season 9 Lee Sin, let me know in the comments what you guys think. Are you excited? You know, what do you want to see? Um, I'm pretty excited. I, I really want the new season. I need, like, new content ideas. Um, so let me know in the comments what you guys are excited for in Season 9. What? Let me know what you think about Lee Sin. And uh, leave a like on this video if you did enjoy. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you're a Lee Sin lover or just like watching Lee Sin plays. Um, that is it. Till next time. I'll see you guys later.